Removing the vacuum table on the M1000 to get this all set up to cut into the floor. We'll also get it taken off of the stand and move it over onto the workbench. So we got all of that all moved over and now we can get the vacuum rails installed. Essentially these just have a couple of bolts that will slide into the T slots on the bottom of the machine. So we'll just getting the bolts all installed here and then we'll get it all slid into those T slots. So everything fit great. We'll get everything all tightened up and then we'll move it over into the workshop after we set the center point. Point. So I used a tape measure just to get the center point. So that way we know where to set everything up. I'll use a little spacer block here to ensure that I'm at the right distance and then get the vacuum all set up. We have two vacuum rails. So we have a vacuum going to each side that goes to a T, which will plug into our vacuum to be able to suck this down to the floor. So you can see once we turn this vacuum on, it is fully sucked down and I would have a really hard time moving this anywhere. I'd pull up the whole floor before I actually got anything done. But anyways, that's going to do it for this one. Look for part two of this in 2022. Have a great day, everybody.